Hello, welcome to my dgpro.com. In this tutorial, I'll tell you how to model this knot in Zorox. Now, first, click on the extruded ball space, select front plane, the skate, and click on the polygon tool, enter 6 in number of sides, and sketch polygon like this. Click OK, click the circle from the same center point and click OK now give the smart dimension of trail and circle and 18 in construction circle of the perimeter polygon and click OK exit skits select mid plane this is because you can mirror the feature entertain in depth and click ok click on helix and spiral select this face and sketch circle in this face enter 6 in radius and click ok exit sketch Select height and piece, enter 15 in height and 1.75 in piece. Click on the reverse direction, enter 0 degree in start angle, select clockwise and click OK. Now click on the top plane. Click on the top lane and click on the skates. Click on the normal tier and sketch polygon. Enter 3 in number of sides and skates polygon like this. Now give a smart dimension like this 10. In y direction and 5.41 in x direction and into one in construction circle of the polygon and click OK. Now zoom the skits environment and click on the shortcut. Scale 3, this one is selected by default and click this one in the path and click OK. Now you can see here this is the quoted part again. Okay. Select this face and click skate and select skate circle in this plane. Enter 8 in radius of 8.5 in radius and click OK. Click on the extruded cut. Click on flip side to cut and click on draft. Enter 45 in length, 45 in angle, and click OK. Now mirror of this feature. Select front plane to mirror face plane and select cut extrude. In the feature to mirror and click OK. This is the knot that you want to create.